Meet Tessa. Today's her birthday. You might say her story began three years and nine months ago when a major ice storm knocked out the electricity in her entire neighborhood. When the local utility discovered the power was off, they dispatched crews to look for trouble spots. Crews can usually restore power quickly, but sometimes storm damage can involve a complicated set of repairs that calls for skilled teams working both inside and outdoors, and this may take more time to complete. So Tessa's parents decided to be patient and stay cozy while they waited for the power to be restored. But you know, even when there isn't a storm, your local utility is always at work for you. They take the high voltage electricity from transmission lines and step it down to a safe level for your home. Every day, they monitor, maintain, repair and update the wires and equipment. They also work to help customers conserve electricity and answer questions about their bills. Tessa is busy playing and doesn't really know anything about any of that. All she knows is when dad flips the switch, the lights come on and the oven is always ready to bake goodies, like her birthday cake. Tessa's parents understand the great value reliable electricity brings, but sometimes find the bill a bit confusing and wonder what all the various charges are for. So let's take a closer look. Electricity charges are for the actual power the family uses. This amount goes to the companies that generate the electricity. Delivery charge is the cost to bring electricity to your house. Some goes to the companies that own Ontario's transmission lines, and some goes to your local utility. Regulatory charges go to the provincial administrators of the system. The province is working to curtail electricity costs in different ways. And there may be more changes to the line items on your bill in the future. So, as you see, even though you receive your bill from your local electricity company, much of the cost is for a province-wide infrastructure that brings that electricity to you. About 25% of the bill goes to the people who look after the power system right here in our town. After all, they live here too. They're our neighbors, people we see every day at the hockey rink or the supermarket. And they're always on the job taking care of our electricity needs, not only for today, but also for the future. We are all connected. And that makes Tessa and her family very happy. Electricity distribution companies, the power to connect in communities throughout Ontario.